So when clients walk into any gym facility, EMS or otherwise, one of the main things that they're usually looking for is to look better and feel better. Exercises like this where they're doing a lot of movement, uh, but not a lot of things are necessarily happening for them. The burpees originated in the military in order to do one thing, and that's weed out young men or the weak who are not able to move forward in their conditioning. So. Applying that to a client doesn't really make sense when their goal is to look good and feel better. Another exercise flaw that is found in the gym is using very light weight and rapid movements to try to produce any kind of change for somebody look, trying to look better. Very similar to the burpee in a way where a lot of different things are happening but not a lot is being done to challenge the body and try to produce or create change. And last one for this week is the common use of uh, unstable training in a client's program. And again, depending on the client and what their goals are, this is typically not a good one for clients trying to train to look better and feel better. One of the things that instability does is that it prevents a client from actually being as strong as they can, uh, which is one of their main goals. Is if we're trying to make them stronger, putting them on unstable surfaces takes their nervous system and puts them in mode of I have to protect myself to not fall over and die, rather than allowing them to be stable so that they can contract and strengthen their muscles as efficiently as possible.